Okay, guys. Earlier, I mentioned about the um, Phoenix 160, and I've managed to get it in the airplane, which is here, as you can see. And I've managed to solder all my connectors to it in place. Um, with this Phoenix Edge 160, um, you do need a back with it and I've put my back just here uh, as you can see um, it's stuck down with double sided tape plus I've got tie wrap with it and also I've soldered the XT30 uh, from the back um, female end and then the male end going back into the live wire and negative wire of the ESC and then I wired it this is just temporary obviously I've got to uh, tie wrap everything in place I as you can see there's two wire lead, there's the wire lead here which runs back into the receiver which is here this one here and then because it's only an eight channel receiver i have to use wire leads um because i've got two independent elevators um and then the other wire lead which I will very, very attempt to plug it in place without doing much damage. And then, and then you have same time as doing this is not going as planned it's not going as planned um, yep that's fine I've got um, this is the um, this is just for testing really um, that's back onto the um, ESC uh, throttle to throttle and now you can just bear with me I'm just gonna let this rest like this before the thing turns itself off or falls over. Right, okay. I'm gonna turn my transmitter on. Make sure my kill switch is on. And... I'm gonna connect the battery pack like so like so it's supposed to be on anti-spark battery pack okay um okay so what we've got here the back is obviously working because if you are looking at the tail end of it, um, it's 
is working. And just going to try. Ha! is doing its job and I am a happy bunny I just got to tidy up all the cable um, everything works um, looking at it and that's how it is everything works and I am a happy bunny all I've got to do is zip tie this um, a bit tighter I'll probably put another one along just here and then making sure all the other wires are tucked in tied in properly and nice and tidy and that is That is a more or less finished project other than zip tie around it all. And I am really happy that I've got this uh, 160 Castle Creation Phoenix Edge ESC. It is definitely compatible with the XPWR35CC. Um, and it doesn't search and that is a great thing. And thanks for watching guys and keep you posted.